family, it's Mel. I'm making my Instagram debut. You may not recognize me. I am new to Ever Eve TV, but not new to Ever Eve. I am actually our chief of stores. If you didn't know, Ever Eve has 90 plus stores across the country, and that's my job. I get to travel around the country and spend time with our store managers and make sure that we have beautiful looking stores with amazing product um, and provide you with an amazing styling experience. So. I am starting Style Curve. So if you looked at my stats, I'm a size 10 to 12, a large across the board. And I really wanna show you how to wear our Ever Eve product. If you are a curvy gal, or you're at the higher end of that size range, as am I, um, I fell in love with Ever Eve product long before I started working for the company and just continue to enjoy working with customers and helping them um, get styled in the fitting room. Let's start, let me tell you about this first outfit. So let me start with the cardigan. This is by Stitches and Stripes. It's really long, I'm about 5'7". One of the best details of this is if you can see in the back that long stripe, so slimming, but just a great added detail. I've got it ruched up today. I don't know about you, but we have been blessed with amazing weather in the midwest so it's a little warm today but this i mean i can't wait when it snows and you want that just cozy piece i have it layered with a t-shirt for a great transitional look but you could wear a hoodie you could wear a sweater under this you could wear it as outerwear it's really a lovely piece um, i have it paired with daydreamers prince t-shirt i don't know about you but i put this on and i immediately went Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to get through this thing called life, and it felt very of the moment. Um, so I love this, and I love some prints. Um, the best thing actually about this outfit, and I must admit, I'm surprised, is the coated denim. I love these. I actually knew I would love the fit. This is cut. This is the Kelsey. If you've tried the Kelsey before, we have several washes. We have a light, a medium, and a little bit more deconstructed look. I have the deconstructed. I've been wearing it for a couple months now. I love it. It is high-waisted, um, and it's got a little bit of flare at the bottom. If you can see it, great with sneakers. I love it. But this is new to me in the coated denim. I haven't bought coated denim in a while, and I have to tell you, um, great new silhouette. Feels just kind of edgy with my P448s, but I can see this in a heel. Um, I heard from Simona, who's one of our managers here in Naperville, that customers are loving this because it's so dual purpose. You can, it doesn't have a ton of sheen to it. I'm gonna get up a little closer. It doesn't have a ton of sheen, so you could wear it to work. Um, you could wear it out on date night, but it's perfect for casual. It just takes your casual outfit up a notch, so I love this. Um, cannot forget the P448. So I'm gonna bring these up. These are the platform. They've got a little bit of snake. Oh boy, let's see if I can do this. A little bit of snake on the back heel, platform on the bottom. So you just get a little bit of height, just kind of elongates your leg. And I just love this casual look. Okay, outfit number two. I have to tell you, I pulled these pieces for a wear to work look, and I, I still think that is true. But as soon as I put them on, I felt very like date night, um, which we have not done in a long time and probably need to figure out a way to do. Uh, maybe wanna like toss my hair a little bit. So let me tell you a bit, a bit about this look. I'm gonna start with jewelry because we really didn't talk jewelry on the last outfit. So I'm gonna take my time with you there. Uh, this is the Andy necklace. It is a three-tiered necklace. So you get three in one, a layered look with the buy of one necklace. I put on this short crop Cardi and this beautiful Cosabella tank. It just felt kind of naked in the middle, but as soon as I put the layered necklace on, it just felt complete. Layered it up with a little cocktail ring, and then don't forget your bracelets. Layering bracelets, fun for every day, but definitely fun for date night or work. Um, if you've been following us for a while, you know the Sadie bracelet. That's our staple. We layer it with everything. New bracelets that come have come in though are the Serena, um, and it comes in this beautiful square, also the chevron. And if you can't see the colors, it's a combo of gold, tans, greens, just a beautiful fall color palette that would go with any of your neutrals. Speaking of neutrals, this Cardi. So many things to say. First of all, the silhouette. If you do not have a cropped Cardi for the season, that should be a piece that you pick up. And this is a beautiful one. This is stitches and stripes, runs very true to size. I'm in large, which is my normal size. Again, I have it layered with this really pretty Costa Bella. It's gray, gray tank. Um, but what I love best is actually the sleeve. 
So let me stand back again, but if you can see, it's just got a great blouse to it, um, which gives it that kind of fun, kind of sexy feel, but it's just beautiful and cozy as well. It's called the nubby uh, cardigan because of this beautiful texture. Comes off khaki, but it's actually a little bit on the blush side. Let me tell you about denim. So this is Good American. If you are a curvy gal and you have not purchased a pair of Good American denim, that is the next investment that you need to make. This is our Good Classic. It's a gray wash, a little bit washed out on the thigh, and it has a great fit. If you've been trying denim lately, you know that the denim fabrication has moved to a little bit more rigid, a little bit less stretch. This is a great middle ground. It has plenty of stretch, but the fabric's pretty rigid. I mean, I feel really tucked in. If you were, you know, if you happen to carry your weight in your middle, this really feels good and makes you feel super confident to wear a little bit more of a cropped piece. Um, you may need to size up. This is a 12 and I go be between a size 10 and 12. I was a 10 in the cut, but in good American, uh, I would really size up in this. And I talked to the girls at the Naperville store. They said that was pretty consistent across all customers. So think about that. Let me tell you about the shoes. I'll bounce back. This is a little pump. I'm going to take it off though, because you just can't, you just can't see the detail. Great texture, beautiful neutral, but my favorite because I'll be honest, I'm not a fan of heels. I love, love my sneakers. It is padded from the heel to the toe. This is actually wearable. Like I think I could style on our styling floor in these. So uh, give this pump a try. If you need to add a great neutral basic pump, um, this is a beautiful one to do. Okay, so I've shown you how to layer on a curvy body type. I've shown you how to wear something crop. And now let's just go back to the tried and true, long over lean, a tunic over a legging. You just can't go wrong. You're gonna feel great in this look. The key is just to update it. Um, update with trend and silhouette and mixing, mixing textures and just make this look more modern. Um, so I layered my necklaces, got a little M initial there for Mel. Uh, this is actually Sanctuary Thermal. I love the Sanctuary brand, but I have to say most of my Sanctuary pieces are a little dressier and this is a great casual piece. So Thermal Waffle Knit, it's got that great kind of very muted cheetah texture. So if you're afraid of prints, this is a great one for you. It's very, very muted. Um, I've paired it back to our Spanx legging. This is just the faux leather. Um, you, you just cannot go wrong with this legging. If you are a curvy gal and you have not purchased a Spanx legging, I encourage you to do that. Um, I buy my new pair each year. My old pair, I turn into my workout wear because they stay with you. I don't know about you, but when I wear leggings, I can kind of have to hike them up through the day and Spanx just stay in place. That's why I love that brand. Um, so love this look, the tunic length, I still feel very confident. I've got a great layer piece here that I'm gonna show you by BB Dakota, but even if I wore this alone, um, I'm thinking Thanksgiving week, I'm cooking dinners for my family, I would feel great in this look. Um, but honestly, before I get to the layering piece and show you that, I just, these boots are so fantastic. That's when I felt great is when I got the shoe on. These are Mark Fisher. This is the Izzy boot. Um, if you have not splurged on this yet, um, or you've not put it on your holiday gift list, I mean, this is just, it, they're so fun. They're so fun and they make every outfit. If you're following influencers, this is the boot of the season. Um, this is a BB Dakota cardigan. We have it in gray. We also have it in black. So you have some choices. Um, this one is a little bit more mid-length. So if you feel like a really long cardigan overwhelms your figure, this one might be a little bit better for you. Um, I am ruching up the sleeves. I think that's a great tip if you're trying to kind of elongate your silhouette with wearing a tunic over a legging, then kind of ruch that up. Just adds a little bit more definition at the waist. Um, I encourage you rather than kind of covering up with the cardigan, really wear it nice and open and blousey. Um, don't hide the curves. Let your silhouette be seen much more slimming. Step back for a minute. Um, when I travel, I'm still hearing that all of our customers, you know, so many of you are working from home. And that's another thing I thought about this outfit. Um, it made me think of the holidays, but it also made me think, you know, wear it on a Zoom call. You look put together, uh, but you're so comfortable. And then wear the boots. No one can see them. Wear them for you. Wear them because you love them. Wear them because they make you feel good. Um, overall, I just think this is a great look.